And Wilds lead pass goes back into the Penguin zone where Ole Mata leaves it there for Latang. Mata and Latang looking good together. Mata, Mata got hit. Mata got leveled. Line. He's down and he's injured. I see. Yeah, he is. He's really hurt. Mata still down as he was hit from behind on the way over there to the boards and he's really hurting right now. Yeah, and he's, he's maybe reaching for that shoulder. He's had two shoulder surgeries, has Matt, and he really got hit hard from behind, trying to make a play right by the wild bench. And I don't, I didn't, I didn't get a good look at it. I can see the hand of Chris Stewart behind the neck right now, Matta, and he's in a lot of pain. Shaking his head, I think he's talking to Chris Stewart right now. So I think he's he's aware of the situation right now. You can see him moving. But they're gonna take their time with him. Well, this guy's been through a lot, Ole Mata. got his arms around the shoulders so I don't you can see that they're taking him out through the Minnesota locker room we'll be back you see the look look at the shove from behind by Nita Ryder and then the door opens helping him off the ice but there's the shove and the door opens up right there and the right hip and the leg area staggy I don't think it was upper body I really don't the way he went off the ice with his arms around the shoulders. And Mike Johnson can't believe it. I can't believe those shoves from behind.